Hello guys, welcome to the episode of the Android Taxi and in this video I am going to tell you how you can flash CWM recovery for your Redmi 2 Prime. Make sure your device is rooted. If you don't know how to root, just watch the video I have given the link in the description. So first off, open your browser and go to Google. It's really hard typing with the camera so the video is kind of slow but you guys can cope up. Now just type in the search bar CWM recovery for Redmi 2 or Redmi 2 CWM recovery. Uh, I'm really sorry guys. It is staying time but just type in Redmi 2 CWM recovery. Oh, I'm really sorry guys. It's really hard to type. CWM recovery. Yeah. Now, just find in the correct link in the description. But I didn't find it first. So you need to do one change in the search bar. Just type in MIUI after recovery. That is why, we, because we have to go to the MIUI forum, not for XDA. So here it is. Uh, just check out if you get anything appropriate but the first link is alright just go to tool tool tips and tut tutorials redmi 2 prime yeah and find the correct link I have already given the link in the description to make things easy for you guys scroll down and how to flash yeah this one how to flash CWM fills TWRP recovery. So you need to have a MI your MI account. So just make sure you have an account and you need to log in. Now these are the links to download. I have given the links for this page in the description. So it says that you have to lo log in, uh, you have to reply for to this thread to the uh, to view the links. So just reply. I'm just typing random shit. So it's small reply, yeah. I'm uh, wrong. Reply. Now just refresh the screen. And here it is. We can now download it. Scroll down and find the link. Make sure you choose correct uh, link for your device. I have 811. You need to check if your device is 813 or 811. It's written on your box. Just tap on that link and it will start downloading. Just tap on click to this link to jump and it started to download. Uh, okay, so it's downloaded now. In the meantime, go to Play Store and search for Flashify. That app is going to be used to flash the recovery image we have downloaded. So go to the play store, type in Flashify and you guys just make sure that you have super user installed Flashify yeah this one Flashify for root users just install it and let me tell you one thing like, like the whole procedure is totally safe you will have no problem but in case anything goes wrong I'm not responsible it's sole like responsibility of yours so don't blame me afterwards now in the meantime where uh, when it's downloading go to download download folder where the recovery file has been downloaded search for it it is a zip file you need to extract it just tap on it don't long press don't just long press no 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 I did mistake my bad just tap on it and tap on extract here so finish e extracting so this is the folder and when I'm going to open it you're going to see a IMG file that is our recovery this thing now just go and check out if flashify is downloaded or not
so here it is completely downloaded and share this video please guys so it's installing flashify now open flashify app accept is going to check for root grant the super user permission if you see something like in app billing just forget it nothing technical problem just tap on recovery image choose file file explorer you see always though go to internal storage go to download or oh, by mistake i pressed boot image recovery image choose file file explorer internal storage it may depend where you have downloaded your file now let's go down and tap on download this is a folder this is the recovery image flash recovery yep so recovery flashing is done just tap on reboot now let's see if it has downloaded or not and please like the video so here it is the recovery it's 6.0.5.1 so it's a touch recovery so this is how you can flash the CWM recovery if you have any problem you can comment below I have no problem this was Ruthwick from Techno oh sorry the Android Taxi yeah I have two channels that's why I get confused so